In his more than 15 years as an actor's actor, what is less known about Edward Norton is the kind of charitable work he's done off camera. Along the way, it was something he noticed about how charities often use the internet that inspired his latest project. We were very frustrated by what we saw out there. Everything was just, we called it like use and drop. You know, it was just a button where you could donate, but really like nothing more. And we wanted to communicate more than that. Norton and his friends saw an opportunity to shake up how people give online. And he came up with what he calls the Facebook of philanthropy. It's called CrowdRise, a fundraising web platform that's also a community. This is the platform where you plant a flag and say, this is who I am as defined by what do I care about, what am I passionate about, what causes do I support. Within minutes, anyone can create a page, start a fundraiser, and ask for donations from friends, family, and perfect strangers. Look, you've got a generation of people coming along who's who's uh, are going to form their own new relationship with the idea of supporting the causes that they care about or changing the world, you know? And these people are not going to do it the way that our parents did it. Which is why Norton was mindful to also make CrowdRise fun, putting the fun in fundraising by adding a gaming aspect. Members can earn points, even win prizes. If you don't give back, no one will like you. If you don't give back, no one will like you. That is our core philosophy. We're a bunch of dorks. He's also a celebrity who's enlisted the help of his famous friends who are creating profiles on CrowdRise just like everyone else, like Will Ferrell, who's raising money for cancer survivors. Like you can win a bottle of Will's suntan lotion for a donation to his site, you know. Um, and it's quite a picture. Yeah, it's a good one. It's very sexy. <laughs> Very sexy. His hope is to revolutionize giving, one web page at a time. I think we really feel like CrowdRise could be, could be something that, that 20 years from now people take for granted because that's just how you do it. Like if you're going to raise some money for something, that's how you do it, you know. And that wouldn't be a bad thing. Huh? No, I, and I think, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I actually, in the beginning we said this like it was a pipe dream, but now I actually think it's going to happen. Alina chose CNN.